Praise the Lord, everyone. Once again, we are continuing with our series of Decide. With me, Omusolo Alpha Kamiya from Scripture Union. And today, our focus will be on letter I, which is identify your values. Values can be defined as principles or standards of behavior. One's judgment of what is important in life. And so, almost everybody has some values that guide their lifestyles. Let us read from Genesis chapter 39, verse 7 and 8. It says, And after a while, his master's wife took notice of Joseph and said, Come to bed with me. But he refused. Many of us would say, Che, what a chance. But then, Joseph has his personal values that always defined his lifestyle. And probably, those are the values that helped him achieve in life. In my high school, I didn't have serious values to guide me. And so, I ended up behaving like a flag. I always followed the direction of the wind. And so I ended up doing the drugs, clubbing, and many of those things. But all these did not yield positive results, but rather to waste my life. I know many of you out there are like that. You are dressing indecently, you're doing drugs, you're tattooing your bodies, and many other things simply because you do not have principles that guide your behavior. What is your worth in life? Are you worth going to lodges with men? Are you worth dating married men or women? Are you worth walking while crushing sugarcane and littering everywhere? If you accept to be lured into sex by just buying you a chapati, that means you are worth a chapati. Those small things define you a lot. And so you need to st stand and raise a standard for yourself. If you set a standard, it will help you define the kind of friends that come into your life. The kind of places you go to, the kind of marriage partners you get, and above all, the kind of treatment you will be given by people. Your values will define your character. Remember, it is said that character is like pregnancy. However much you hide it, it will always come out. Let's have the right values that guide us, and this will help us live a straight life. The fact is that your life can't be worth anything on earth. So, I challenge you to guard it well by developing self-values that will help you. God bless you, and I love you all.